Hey guys, it's just me, Kirsten. Today we're just going to be doing kind of a side braid. I'm taking about a one and a half section, one and a half inch section right here, and I'm just going to start braiding it in a three strand braid. Now I'm just going to be taking little pieces on each side and adding it to each section and then crossing the middle piece over and this is just going to start making a French braid. I kind of wanted to give this braid some dimension so that's why I started with the three strand and kind of went to a French braid just to make it look a little bit different. Now at the end of the braid here, I'm going to kind of loosen up some pieces just because I don't want it to make that weird bend that it's making right now. And then I'm kind of going to pull the section back and loosen up the pieces where I want them to to make the braid look more thick. Now you're just going to pin the hair. I pinned one going forward and one for one backward, kind of hiding the bobby pin, and throwing a piece from behind my hair over it just to kind of hide it. And this is the finished look, guys. I just thought this would be cute to kind of spice up an everyday kind of look. If you guys wanted to add some volume to this, you could just put some tees right in the back of the crown area and on the sides a little bit before you do this braid. Um, I just wanted to do something quick and easy. Now we're going to go into the more complicated section. I took um, the braid that we had before and I kind of made it more of a twisty, so I just kind of twisted the hair over top itself. And now I'm just taking little pieces of that part of the twist that was left out and I'm flipping them into a circle and I'm pinning them into place. So as you can see I'm twisting the piece of hair and I'm twisting it into a circle and I'm going to pin that to my head here. Make sure to play around with this and get the right placing. You kind of want the circles to show because it's kind of supposed to be like a sideway heart. I wanted to get this up for Valentine's Day, but I just didn't have the time. But again, like I said, just try to find where you can get the right placement and try to hide those bobby pins. Now I'm going to take the ends of those twisties and I'm going to kind of... Uh, twist those as well and intertwine them with each other. Now that I have them intertwined, I'm just going to pin them back so that it's kind of going back toward my hair to give that sideway, sideways um, heart looking shape. And this is the finished look, guys. I just really thought this was different and unique. It's kind of a messy side heart-shaped braid thing. I know it's different, but I really thought this was kind of cute. And if you wanted, again, to get some more volume in your hair, you could just put some tees on the side and in the back. I hope you guys really like this. And I'm going to be coming out with some more videos this week, so let me know what you would like to see in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. And I love you all. Thanks for watching.